I'm curious, like particularly with you guys being in the music industry and more in particular being entrepreneurs, how those two things have had an impact on your mental health because um, entrepreneurship is very uh, unexpected to say the least. I think is that the, the best way to say it. Um, it's not, doesn't always feel stable and secure. Um, and then again, with you guys, again, being in the music industry and some of those stigmas and expectations, um, you know, Jess, I've heard you talk a lot about like kind of that no sleep mentality and you got to grind all day and all night. And I'm curious how just being in the music industry or um, an entrepreneur has, you know, impacted your mental health in some way. Yeah, definitely. Um, I mean, I think like you said, there there's this mentality, you know, no sleep and, you know, in the music industry, there are going to be a lot of times where you're not going without sleep, but it's definitely not to the point where it looks like, you know, on social media and what it's made to be look like, um, um, you know, we dream of leaving our nine to fives to do this music, not realizing when you leave your nine to five and do this music, it is now 24 seven. Um, one thing that happened with me is my level of anxiety, getting text messages and emails to the point where I wake up in the middle of the night just to check my email to see if somebody is waiting for something from me. And if they were, I was jumping out of bed, you know, whatever time in the morning it was just to go get that taken care of because I was worried. Oh, you know, they're going to be worried. Where's Justin at? Why isn't he responding to me? When in reality, they don't care. They're asleep too. So I think a lot of these things, um, you know, working for yourself, you realize you're not getting that paycheck every week or two weeks anymore. It's all on you to bring that money in. And the second it starts slowing down, you start questioning things. You start realizing, you know, did I make the right choice here? Um, so it's really just kind of taking a step back, having faith in yourself. I mean, we all got to this point somehow, you know, whether you sold your first beat last week or you're on the process. If you're even just putting up beats on beat stars, you're doing a lot more than some of these other people are. So it's taken a lot to get to this process. Just have faith in what you're doing, believe in yourself. And just know this is a process, you know, this is a marathon. We're all racing to the same spot. We're all yeah. going to accomplish this all different, you know, just have a little faith. Yeah, it is. Um, it's definitely a marathon with entrepreneurship. I always try and tell people like uh, they say on average, it takes two to three years to make a profit for your business. And I feel like people, they, they launch a business and they have this expectation that, you know, just like that, I'm going to make what I was making it more. And it's not. It's a journey. And especially, um, you know, when you're starting a business, you're starting from your zero. The company you worked at has probably been around 5, 10, 15 years. They've already gone through that phase, right? So the the money that you're seeing and the success, you didn't see the countless hours of, of time they put in. And so, yeah, I think remembering um, what you said, Jess, is really important that, you know, when you're doing this, you're not trading a nine to five for another nine to five. This becomes a 24 seven, but you also have to know when to turn it off. You know what I mean? Like we do not want you guys jumping out of bed <laughs> to respond to emails or to get back to somebody. Um, just as important as it is to be successful in your business, it's also important to be um, just successful in, in your well-being and care about those things too. So it's awesome to hear that um, you've kind of learned to navigate that expectation and, and um, pressure not only you may put on yourself or that you feel like your customers are, you know, may put on you too.